Spooky Adventures with Little Boo Once upon a time, in a quiet little town, there lived a tiny friendly ghost named Little Boo. Halloween was just around the corner and Little Boo was very excited. This year, he wanted to have the spookiest and most fun Halloween ever. One sunny morning, Little Boo floated to his best friend, Spoo, the black cat. Meow, Little Boo, what are you up to? Spoo asked with a playful twinkle in his eye. I want to have a spooky adventure, Spoo. It's almost Halloween and I've never really scared anyone before, replied Little Boo with a sigh. Spoo purred, don't worry, Little Boo. We'll figure something out together. How about we visit the pumpkin patch? There are lots of pumpkins there, perfect for Halloween. Excited, Little Boo and Spoo floated over the pumpkin patch, where they found all kinds of pumpkins. Look, Spoo, these pumpkins are so big and round. Maybe we can make funny faces on them, Little Boo said. That's a great idea, Little Boo. Let's give these pumpkins some silly spooky faces, Spoo suggested. With their tiny ghostly hands and furry paws, they carved out eyes, noses and toothy grins on the pumpkins. Little Boo tried to make his pumpkin the spookiest, while Spoo aimed for the silliest. They giggled and laughed as they carved. Once they finished, Little Boo placed a candle inside each pumpkin. As the sun began to set, the pumpkins glowed with an eerie, warm light. Little Boo and Spoo knew they had creating something truly special. Wow, Little Boo, our pumpkins look fantastic, Spoo said. I'm so happy, Spoo, but how we can share them with our friends? Little Boo wondered. Just then, they heard tiny footsteps. It was Lila and Sam, two of their toddler friends from the town. Look, little boo, spooky pumpkins! Lila exclaimed with wide eyes. Little Sam pointed and giggled. Meow, funny faces! Little boo and Spoo smiled. Their spooky pumpkins made their friends happy, not scared. Would you like to take these pumpkins home for Halloween? Little Boo asked, hoping it was okay with their friends. Lila and Sam nodded enthusiastically, holding the pumpkins tightly. Thank you, Little Boo and Spoo, Lila said. The four friends floated back to the town, with their pumpkins glowing brightly. The townspeople were amazed by the cute and spooky pumpkins that the little ones had created. The Halloween night, Little Boo, Spoon, Lila and Sam went trick-or-treating together, holding their pumpkins with pride. They had the spookiest and most fun Halloween, not because they scared anyone, but because they made their town shine with happiness. Little Boo realized that Halloween wasn't just about being spooky, it was about sharing joy with friends. He learned that being friendly was even better than being scary. And so, the little ghost named Little Boo continued to have many more adventures with his friends, making every Halloween the spookiest and happiest for everyone in the town. The end.